Yucca is a dryland perennial shrub in the agave family, commonly found in semi-arid regions of North America and Mexico. It can thrive within a variety of habitats, including high deserts, open plains, and grasslands. It prefers full sun and well-drained soils and can survive even through the winter months. The fruit, flower petals, young shoots, stalk, and roasted roots are all edible and have been used as a wild food source by indigenous people for thousands of years. Yucca plants have long, stiff, blade-like leaves that grow from a rosette on a thick, woody stem. The flowers of the yucca plants are white, bell-shaped, and grow on tall stalks out of the center of the plant that rise above the foliage. The fruit of the yucca plant is a fleshy capsule that contains seeds and resembles a small, elongated pear or bell pepper. It is typically greenish-brown in color and has a tough, fibrous exterior that protects the seeds inside. The interior of the yucca fruit is filled with numerous small seeds that are surrounded by a sweet, juicy, edible flesh. So what parts of the yucca are edible and how do you prepare them? The flower petals, flower stalks, and fruits can all be eaten cooked or raw. The flower petals are great sautéed with olive oil, butter, and garlic. The young fruits can be bitter raw but are far tastier roasted until tender. Scrape out the pulp from the inside and remove the seeds. The pulp can be sweetened and used as a high carbohydrate, filling for pies, or as a mashed potato-like side dish. The seeds can be roasted in the oven until dry and eaten like homemade pumpkin seeds. Young immature flower stalks harvested long before they blossom are also edible and can be prepared like a larger version of asparagus. If the stalk is more mature and becoming fibrous, peel and cut into sections then boil for 30 minutes until tender. Yucca is high in vitamin C, B, and A, calcium, phosphorus, potassium, and iron. It is also higher in fiber and potassium than a potato. Yucca can be beneficial to people with arthritis and rheumatism because it has a high content of steroid saponins that are precursors to cortisone and act as anti-inflammatory molecules. Yucca has many other uses as well. Its tough fibrous leaves can be broken down into individual fibers and used for weaving. Archaeological sites have yielded traps, snares, baskets, sandals, and clothing made from yucca fibers. Yucca rope is a natural fiber that is made from the leaves of the yucca plant. The leaves are stripped of their outer layer and the fibers within are separated, cleaned, and then twisted into a rope. The rope is a durable and flexible material that has been used throughout the ages by Native American craftsmen. Yucca can also be made into a soap. The saponin-rich roots of the yucca plant contain natural detergents that produce a soapy lather when mixed with water. This organic soap is gentle on the skin and effective in cleaning and removing dirt and oil.